Welcome to another episode of Salty Food Reviews. Today, we have another McDonald's worldwide favorite item. It is, the, it is from Australia. It is the tomato mozzarella chicken sandwich. Comes this little box right here. You know, I like that they're doing this. It, it's pretty cool. You know, I already did the first item, the first thing that looked good, so I gotta do the other one. Ooh. Okay. So this is uh this is like a potato bun or like an artisan roll bun. This is what it looks like. And um on this chicken sandwich right here, we have the tomato. I'm a, I'm gonna organize that a little bit better. The lettuce. And on the top, there's slivered onions and their tomato and herb sauce. So, oh yeah, you got the tomato herb sauce on the bottom too. It's just leaking out right there. Look at that, it's just waiting. It's just calling me. Oof. And um, this tomato herb sauce, uh, what is in it? We got some, we got some extra herb, virgin olive oil in it. We got some garlic clove. We got some red pepper flakes, we got some onion, mm. fresh, freshly chopped, we got some tomato sauce of course, we got water, sugar, basil, oregano, thyme, and parsley. Woo. You hear all that? Not not that, the, the, the ingredients in this though. So. I just want to take a taste of it. Mmm. Mmm, that's really good. Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. I'm not sure what it tastes like. All right, when I took the second lick, it kind of tasted like a donut. So that was weird. Well, I'm gonna take a bite. Mm-hmm. Mm Mm-hmm. That chicken is thick. Oh my god. Strong flavor on the chicken right there. The mozzarella cheese is super subtle. You barely even taste it, but it's there. I mean you somewhat do. It goes nice with the tomato and lettuce. I don't know if you guys ever put mozzarella cheese uh and tomato and like a little bit of basil on a cracker and had it before. Ooh, that's so good. But this sandwich you know, mm hmm. As good as it is, it is missing something. Ooh. Needs a little bit of salt. Just a little pinch. What do you say about that, Hilda? I got, I got Hilda in the back. Just hold on one second. I gotta grab her. He's a little paralyzed right now from the knees down. Yeah. Hilda, wake up. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, right here. You know, she's just looking at the sandwich right now. Are you hungry? She doesn't like to talk a lot, especially on camera, so she's not going to really look at you. She's looking at the sandwich right down there. Damn. I think, you agree that we should put some more salt on this? She nodded her head. You didn't see her, but she nodded her head. So, where did I put that? Oh, here it is. Let's take a little bit of this. This a little bit here. Yeah. Dress it up real quick. Mm.
Oh yeah. Now that's a lot better. Mm-hmm. That's what I call a sandwich. Mm. And I got this. It was five ninety nine. After tax, it became six forty seven. And it's hot as fuck in this house. Now it's hot. Summertime heat, baby. I wish there was a little bit more lettuce and they could lose the onions and put something out maybe a little more sauce and lose the onions because the sauce is there it's just very subtle as well as the mozzarella cheese but, I mean, it's there. It's definitely there. It's more than the uh, Grand Extreme McBacon where they gave me two teaspoons. This is at least on the bottom, too. Kind of like, it's kind of covered the whole thing. But the chicken is just so overpowering. It just kind of, it takes up everything else. Besides the tomato, which is interesting. I like this though. It's different. You know, you go to McDonald's, if you go there a lot, and you just get a normal chicken sandwich or a buttermilk crispy chicken sandwich, and it's the same damn thing every time. And it gets boring, you know? And I feel like that's why they started bringing these new items in, because it just it brings variety, different flavor. It's like, oh, okay, this is better. Which it is. I mean, some people may not think so if they really like that original American like flavor of the sandwiches but in my opinion this is where it's at mm. Mm, mm, mm. well I told her to take a bite come here now she doesn't want to get up but here come on mm. I have my stuff down mm. No. Take a bite. Very good. Tomato mozzarella chicken sandwich from McDonald's. Worldwide favorite from Australia. It's amazing. What'd you think about it? I'm trying to talk to Hilda, bro. Did she talk to you? Does Hilda ever talk to you? No. I haven't ever heard her speak. Like, really, ever. Like, she writes notes and stuff, because she's paralyzed from the knee down, but... Right now, she... I think she just wants to be alone, so I'm just not going to bother her. Let her do her thing. Take a look at this right here. Mm-mm. More salt. Their chicken is so good, dude. I'm not even gonna lie. 
Like, it is perfect. Everything on this was layered perfectly. Everything tasted great. They could have lost the onions, put a little bit more sauce or a different sauce, or maybe a little bit more lettuce or tomato. You know what I mean? Lose the onions, give a little bit more of something else. Only problem I have with this. Mm. Now that, that's what I call a chicken sandwich, okay? Not a McChicken, I don't know what that is. That, tomato mozzarella chicken sandwich from McDonald's. Rate I give it, a nine. I think that's the highest rating I've ever gave any food on this channel. A nine, guys. They're out for a limited time. Just came out recently. Go get them today. There's like a couple more things. But I did the two sandwiches. My last video was the Grand Extreme from Spain. This one was, you know, the one from Australia. The chicken sandwich. 9 out of 10. Go get it. I have no complaints. I mean, I, 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 I brought Hilda in the video because I wanted her to give a rating and a review. But she wouldn't. I'm not sure if she swallowed it. Or not. It's just kind of like sitting on her lip a little bit. Clean that up. But, yep. Salty food reviews. This gets a nine, people. This is the best thing out of the worldwide favorites. Or this is better than the uh, the grand make the grand extreme that they have, in my opinion. This is better. As I mean, it's probably better for you. It's chicken. So get it. Check my previous videos. Listen to my music in the description. Run up my social media. Let me know what to review next. Let me know if I should do more of the worldwide favorite um, items. Well, all they really have left is the cheesy bacon fries, which is just cheese and bacon on fries. And uh, some sort of vanilla ice cream from the Netherlands that's served with like a Dutch waffle thing mixed into it. I mean, but yeah, if you guys want me to do those, let me know. If not, let me know something else. As always, it's been Salty Food Reviews. Y'all stay beautiful. Stay loved.